first to arrive today, it's the crimson-lipped femme fatales vying for a lead role in the multi-award-winning West End musical Chicago. Hello. Hi. How are you? I'm good, thank you. How are you? Hello. Good morning. What's your name? Hey, Millie O'Connell. Millie O'Connell. Hello, lovely, lovely to, to meet you. you. What's your name? Susie Blues. I'm an actress and I've done West End shows before. In fact, I was in Chicago when it was in the West End. I played the part of June nearly 20 years ago, but then decided to have a family. So I've had a break for about 10 years, and now I'm back and auditioning for this. You nervous? You look serene. Do I? Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> cool comfort. It's called acting. It's crazy to think that it's my profession, that I get to go into a room and kick my legs around, sing a little song, maybe do a little bit of acting, and then I'll find that if I've got my next job. There's not many roles where someone really dances and sings and really acts and it gets to be sexy and funny. It is an iconic part. You have to do so many auditions. This should become routine, it should be easy, part of your job, take it in your stride, but it's horrible. Yeah, auditions are really brutal. To get the job, our budding Velmas will need to impress casting director Stephen, music director Ian, Dance Captain Matthew and resident director Stacy. But um, but Velma Kelly, she's a strong woman, and it needs to be a woman. It can't be a girl. <laughs> this is a huge role for somebody. Everybody in the West End, everybody in the industry knows it's a tough gig. So when you get it, you know that you've cracked it. <laughs> Ladies, we're ready. We are going through. Come on in. First up for the auditionees is a test of their dancing ability. The panel want to see if they can take the Chicago choreography in their stride. So what we're going to do first is Matt's going to jump up and he's going to teach you a couple of little bits of the routine. Let's go, team. So all we're doing is a simple Charleston. Forward and back and da 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 Full. Cool, let's do it once more. Yeah, thank you. And one and back and side and back. Slap. Push, 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 push. Shimmy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Are you all right, sweetie? I'm absolutely fine. I'm worried about the Turkish run. Don't worry about that. Love her face. Well done, ladies. <laughs> ladies, give us one second to talk amongst yourself. I've got four girls that I would say no to me. I've got one, two, three. Okay, ladies. You all did amazingly well, but we are going to make a cut now. So, can Verity please stay? Laura, Madeline, and Lauren. We'll have you in one at a time to sing your songs. The other ladies, thank you very much. Really appreciate you coming. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. It was really good fun. It's just really great to get up there and do it again. And who knows what's around the corner. Uh, have a good day with us. Nice to see you. Safe journey. Have fun. So there's four Velmas remaining. Up first is Laura. Hi. Hi, Laura. How are Hi. you? Hi, I'm good. How are you? How are you? Yeah, great, thank you. My mum and dad were um, members of a dramatic society, so I kind of grew up in and around the theatre. You know, that was my whole world. Can you tell us a little bit about yourself? I'm Laura Tyra. I'm 35. Oh, bless you, but you don't have to tell us your records. <laughs> <laughs> I've done Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, Matilda, and I've done Chicago. But I've never played a leading role. Start by admitting from cradle to tomb Isn't that long a stay? Life is a cabaret, old chum only a cabaret old chum And I love a cabaret! Excellent. 
Excellent. Bravo, Laura. Thank you. Thank you. I mean, that was just yeah, slammed it out of the park. Yeah.